Good morning. It's a fine Saturday fall. Wait a minute, that was wrong. A fine fall Saturday? There we go. Um, and I'm going to video a few of my boy two to four boxes for you here. Um, boys two to four are one of the smallest groups in number of boxes they receive, but then you must consider also there are only three ages in a two to four, two, three, four. Versus your other age groups have five different ages of child in them. So um, the numbers work out about the same. But a lot of people aren't sure what sort of toys or things would be appropriate um, for the youngest and the oldest boys. I'm not sure why that is. So I have several here I packed for this age group. And I'm going to film three of them, I think, here this morning. So this one is Ocean Pirates theme. So when he opens it up, uh, on top he has an outfit. So he has a pair of shorts. Um, the tag still says $3, but I actually paid one. Um, I asked the manager if I took all of the big sizes, if she would give them to me for less. And I think I got over 100 pairs that day for myself and my church. And you can kind of see the underneath the shorts there. Um, and I keep going back to this box and adding more things. He has a little Blue and white striped shirt. I didn't have anything that had an appropriate pirate or something like that on it, so I went with the blue and white stripe, thinking it was a bit of a nautical theme. So there's his outfit. These are size four for the shirt, and the shorts are actually a 3T, the elastic waistband. Okay, so he has a baby shark. This is actually a coin purse. I figure he can use it as a stuffy, or maybe he'll put rocks in it. I don't know. Seashells? Could be. So he's got that stuffy. He also has a little lobster stuffy. This is just one of those um, McDonald's beanie babies from way back when. Um, whenever I get a collection from someone, sometimes I buy them off Facebook Marketplace. Sometimes they're given to me. I love to get these little, little ones to fill in space. He has a couple of rubber animals, an octopus and a turtle. These are meant to be bath toys, but you don't have to use them in the water. And he's got a couple boats. This little guy, they come in sets, um, and then the boats are numbered 1 through 10, but I'm just sending like one boat to each kid. Um, so when you buy them in a set, you can find them on Amazon. Um, there's Badat brand, which is a brand of toys that I really like. They're really well made. Um, this one is a bad at. And, but then there are some off-brand ones too. So they're just nice, sturdy. It's, it's going to last them a real long time. Um, so they're just kind of fun. So he has a boat. He has another boat here, uh, which is a sailboat. It's part of a three-pack from Summer Toys. Mm, I'm trying to remember if it was Rite Aid or Walgreens had three little sailboats in a pack. So he has a sailboat too. Uh, washcloth. Okay. Stuffed in there. A pair of socks stuffed in. A beach ball. Because after all this is oceany beach themed. And a beach ball is a nice way to get an age appropriate large ball into a two to four. Because um, these are rated for two-year-olds, so if you're one of the people that worries about size of items, choking hazards, that sort of thing with the two-year-olds, the beach balls are fine. Um, then he has a little set of toys. This is from a show I have not watched, but it's a Disney Santiago. Um, so this is Santiago. He's the captain of the ship. And then he's got a little mouse friend in here, a couple little... Mice friends, a mouse on an airplane. Just a fun little toy. And I figure Mr. Santiago can go in the boat. He might tip over the boat, but that'll be fun to explore. See if he tips over the boat. So Santiago and his friends went in a Ziploc bag. Yeah. Just to keep the pieces together, I also cut off a little piece of the package. So it says, oh no, sorry, not Santiago. This is Enrique. I'm wrong. Uh, Enrique has his name. I guess Santiago's the other kid. Um, 
in the picture. But there we go. A pair of underwear. I do put underwear in all my boxes. I try to put socks in all my boxes too. This is, what size is this one? This is a size four. And I usually do size four in toddler boxes um, because you can always wear something too big, but have you ever tried to wear underwear that's too small? It's not pleasant. The little necklace, somebody donated a whole bunch of Mardi Gras type beads. This one's got an alligator or a crocodile? Anyway, it's going with the theme. And I know the little guys like the necklaces too. Pencil sharpener, this one has dual hole because I've sent him some of the, I sent him a giant pencil too, the preschool size, and then some regular pencils and an eraser. Uh, and I put them in the baggie, so like if mom wants to hold on to this, mom can just easily grab this out of the box and hold on to that uh, for when she wants to let them have it. We got a toothbrush and an Ikea spoon. These are very inexpensive. Um, I love these. You can get them. When I got these, they were like five cents, but... Um, You'll get a set of a spoon, a fork, and a knife, which you can send, uh, the plastic knives. You can even send metal butter knives. It's just no sharp ones. Um, so that when you buy the sets, you can get like a set of silverware for 33 cents because um, it comes six for $2. Some play school flashcards. These are just colors and shapes. I tend to do simple ones, um, color shapes, or basic math when I do send them. Uh, just a little frisbee disc. It's got John 316 on it. It's a little trading, I believe. Magnetic funny faces with pirates. <laughs> That's why the pirate came in here. And it's got the tin to keep all the pieces in. A lot of these things are rated for three year olds and up and I know some people might not like that but I think we're I'm gonna trust God sends it to the right boy uh, just a little baby book it's got Captain Hook on the front and uh, so I picked this one it's just cute little pictures there's the crocodile there's stitch it's just a fun little one it's just colorful um, I got these in sets from Walgreens around Christmas time. Um, I got them after for clearance. Just a little sketch pad, crayons. I've got some stickers, both some Jake and the Neverland Pirates and some Go Diego Go, which I thought were appropriate boy stickers. Also some Christmas stickers. A book about Happy Hermit Crab. Happy Hermit Crab, a uh, card with a note from myself, including my contact information. Lucy, you can't help. The cat wants to help. Um, some Jake stickers, more Jake stickers. And then we have some Jake color sheets, a bunch of different pirate, Disney pirate. It's got the crocodile and hooks in here somewhere. And then also a Deep Sea Friends color book. It has stickers too. More stickers. And then some pages are really basic and some are a little more. This is from Dollar Tree. I love their selection of color books. And then he also has a notebook in there. One subject, wide ruled. And I picked blue just to go with the ocean kind of thing going on here. So, aside from my coffee, there we go. A uh, pirate-themed box for a little boy aged 2 to 4. If you have any comments or questions, please feel free to leave them below. Thank you for watching.